Hello everyone, I'm Megan. And I am Jessie. Jessie, your plant is not looking so good. I know. Our family went on vacation, so I left my plant outside and uh, I thought the rain would keep it watered, but I guess it didn't rain. Oh, not from the looks of it. But your plant reminds me of today's Bible story. It does? How? In today's Bible story, God caused a drought. During a drought, there is no rain for a long time and plants cannot grow. Israel did not have rain for three whole years. Whoa, three years is a long time. Why would God do that? He had a good reason. Let me tell you what happened. Ahab became the king of Israel. He was not a good king. Ahab led the Israelites to worship false gods instead of the one true God. Ahab's evil ways made God angry, so God sent the prophet Elijah to talk to Ahab. Elijah said, no rain will fall in Israel for three years. This was how God would punish the people for worshiping gods that were not real. Elijah's words came true. Without rain, the people did not have water and they could not grow food to eat. After three years, Elijah went back to King Ahab. He told the king, meet me at Mount Carmel. Bring the people of Israel and the prophets who worship false gods like Baal. The king and the people went to the mountain. Elijah said to the people, do you believe the Lord is God or do you believe in Baal? You must choose. Elijah set up a contest to show who the one true God is. The worshipers of Baal made an altar for their false god. You call to Baal, Elijah said, ask him to send fire to your altar. I will call on the Lord. The God who answers by sending fire is the one true God. From morning until noon, the false prophets called out to Baal, but no one answered. They danced and cried loudly to show they loved Baal, but Baal was still silent. Then Elijah made an altar, dug a ditch around it, and put on a pile of wood. He asked for water to be poured on the wood. The altar was very wet. Elijah prayed, answer me, God, so that these people will know that you are God. God answered Elijah by sending fire from the sky. The fire burned up the bull, the wood, the stones, the dust, and the water. God showed everyone that he is the one true God. The people who were watching fell to the ground. They said, the Lord, he is God. The Lord, he is God. Soon the sky grew dark with clouds and God sent rain. The one true God is not like false gods. We do not have to work hard to show God we love him. Instead, God showed his love for us by sending his son Jesus to be the savior of the world.